Good morning, guys. <clears throat> oh, you guys will be great. Great news. Great news to announce today. So usually I talk about my schedule today. I got my meds finally. So I got um, I got some meds. Got some pills. So uh, I'm good to go. I just um, should be getting them about three days. Hopefully, hopefully my cough goes away in like three days. Steroids. Actually, they didn't give me steroids. They gave me another anti-inflammatory, which I was kind of... I'm not really the... Anyways, no, it's good. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'm all healed up. Anyways, um, today was probably my first day of like decent sleep. Like, good sleep. I ended up sleeping from... Wait, is this the day? I mean, I'm ending my stream. I... Sorry, guys. <laughs> someone, thank God, someone messaged something because I completely fucking forgot. I have somewhere to be in about two hours, <clears throat> so I can stream for an hour. Um, but that'd be even enjoyable. I feel like it's just an hour stream. One TFT game. All right, I'll stream for one. One hour stream. All right, we're fucking skipping uh, TFT then. We're going straight to Monster Hunter. Actually, no, I'm kind of down to chill with TFT. It's definitely a more relaxing game. Um... Oh my god, literally when the Pistis had um someone not a big DM chat for something. And I would have completely missed it. How long am I streaming for today? One hour. Total. Um, Lily. Oh my god, Lily planned the thing a week ago and I forgot. Oh my god. 
Fuck yeah. No, no, no. Forgetting means I don't show up. I'm going to be there. Mm -hmm. Where do I want to go? Here? Happy two hours? Oh. I go somewhere. Which I completely forgot. Impossible comebacks are sort of my specialty. Hmm. Someone to have a cast of him? Nope. I'm down to just leave. What? These are so unfun. It's actually ridiculous. No. I literally got hit with the no fun zone just now. I. Uh... Cram session? It's just really bad to start with cram session. You don't know if you actually be able to get to academy. Also, cramp session is best if you get academy spats, so it's just like... You should have played for that with what? I have zero academy. It's just a dead argument early, it's so bad. Ha! Let's begin again. I can do this. I have my orders. You see this? I didn't hit anything. I have, I have three pairs. Orders. Game. Not after slamming this. I could have ran GA plus tier. I just think GA is kind of a not a great item. Feels okay. So is the caller is the worst five class? It's probably the most Ivy specific. Oh man. This guy leveled with metabolic because he's so strong. Holy fuck. I want actually. Nice. 
We are lost. Oh my god, one auto. Chame, Gordol, to master. Thanks for someone with this stream. Hmm. What do I do here? Definitely just being sold. I can switch to Let's this for mine. Probably just level here. I kind of see what happens. I'm not sure if there's any other cable players, but I just move them out a little bit. Yeah, this guy got Thornmail. Honestly, if he he got Sunfire, that'd be the worst thing. But he didn't get Sunfire, so it's fine. The fuck do I want? Try one none of these. Oh man. That's you as well. Oh my god. Is everyone Omega fucking strong or what? How am I losing with this board? What? Huh? Wait, I, I'm actually kind of confused. I'm losing with this board? I didn't lose, so I thought I might carry you. <laughs> cool. So um, I'm 84 with 4 loss, level 520. That's not that bad.
This looks like an Arcanist slash Victor game, by the way. Level 640, really good spot. Problem is, I don't have like chalices or anything to increase my damage, so. Seraph to one of the 1200, and then she just does zero damage for the rest of the fight. Unless you're from high strong to get her second cast. Five Merkman Street. Sure. Let's bounce. I have an idea. I'll play Loser Victor. I just need to get Archangels. I'm good to go. I also need uh, Morellas. But I don't think I have many items right now. Matthew so... literally super damaged this fan here. My Seraphine has ulti four times, three times. Oh, I got six of them. Holy shit. Real syndicate. Let me get if I take the syndicate spat. I have to take this because not only is it a Seraphine, it's also half a Morello or half a Seraph. So it's really, 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 really top tier. These are such bad augments. Or at least not very fun augments to play. Tonight, I'm feeling greedy.
I was just trying to have fun with them. I would it. This guy is kind of weak. Oh, no, never mind. He has fucking BIS Warwick. I don't mind losing it. I hope I just lose by a little bit, though. Like, one unit would be nice. Yeah, at least by one unit. That's, that's really good. He is BIS Warwick with Chemtech and Challenger Crest. Okay. Really good loss. Should we it today? No idea. Probably. Let's get cracking. It's definitely great. I just need Morellas on here. It's fine. You didn't learn? Oh, there's nothing to learn. I think I'm going to hate this game, if I'm going to be honest. I need to replace this with two bruisers. I think I have... Uh, I almost have them. I need a missing... Mundo, and I'm good to go. The only build that lets me win is Yordles. Yeah, Yordles are really fun. But they're really hard to play once you get higher and people start fucking owning you. I've only won one, one round in the last two stages. Kind of mad at Wanda that round, by the way. I need a Morello. I need a. I'm gonna just play Victor Arcanus. It's, it's gotta be a lot of items, right? Swinging from the heels. I'm not the forfeit. Okay. I'm the, I'm down the forfeit. Huh? I literally, I guess I'm playing Urgot, but I'm pretty sure Urgot's not a real unit. I'll like I back what's mine. Oh man. I'm like a hundred percent sure Urgot's not a real thing. Explorers game. follow the compass in their heart. We're gonna see how bad it is. Wow, I got. 7 0 by this guy. Huh. Am I going up here? I only have 10 gold. That doesn't seem good. I feel like I need to go for other things. Sing along. I'm I I'm lost. But at least every team has like a shit with base damage. So I can kill I can kill stuff at least. I don't think I roll again until four or five. I need to hit a lot of regrets. I think I'm supposed to slam beat. I don't really want to slam beat T with Thrill. Like, I feel like I'm playing Urgot. But if I'm playing Urgot, that means this game's fucking doomed, right? Like, uh, me having to play Urgot is like. Like, it's, it's fucking doomed, It's how it feels.
All right, I can top seven. Oh god. Well, this guy has Jace with really fucking good items. I think those items aren't super good except for against me too, because I have bruisers, so his GS gets like insane value, right? Seraphine broken? What would the fuck was that? Is Seraphine kind of... Kind of smurf or what? Oh my god, I think I can- I think I can save my game. Maybe, 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 maybe. I need damage on this unit, by the way. Who knows if I can get there? Or I, can, I need a spat. Actually, really nice. I really don't want to roll to later, if possible. All these are really good units. We'll probably play six reasons for a while. I think I can drop to four, but it's gonna take me a lot of upgrades, so. I demand an entree. Ready for trouble. It means Omni, which is really fucking good to splash. I don't even know if I would. Oh man. Honestly, Seraphine's kind of lit. That for replacing all these Bruiser Tech, Oriana puts Braum. Nah, probably not. Dude. Oh, I didn't move. That guy has fucking shroud on me again? God, this motherfucker. I hasn't moved the shroud since the fucking first. Oh, man. I think I could have saved, like, or killed three people here. He has instant injection, wow. Where's Warwick 3? Damn. He's got, like, an optimal Warwick uh, comp. Always soon change. A bargain is due. Okay. That bails me out quite hard. I just need 5 chem tech with uh, Urgot. We drop down the Cloak Loser. And I play... Spatty? You're in my kingdom now! By your command. Let's get to oh, the fun This is really part. interesting what I just did there. Existence is... Torment. You 
Bongo goes where he pleases. This is who I am. Oh, how much did I ever got, dude? It wasn't even that bad. Hmm. Hmm. I think I really needed. Fuck. I don't. I don't know if I did Morello more than Archangels, but at some point I kind of feel like it felt like it, where I needed. It just I think it items and then the items I did get kind of ended up being a little scuffed. I got uh, kind of late items and then the items were opposite of what I kind of wanted to end up doing. Sorry, I'm gonna go play some hats. Uh, no, no, I can play one more. I can play one more. Pretty sure. Yeah, I can play one more. Yeah, I lost so fast, I think I have game enough for one more. Mm -hmm. I watch LCS. I don't care about LCS. I haven't cared in a couple of years. Nothing against the product or the show or the people. I just have no attachment or any desire to watch competitive League of Legends domestically. Best way to contact you about cameo in the game? Ugh, honestly, Twitter DMs maybe. But like, I, I want to say it's just not something I'm very much interested in. Minus maybe like a huge IP that I that I play like nonstop. Mm. 
Which one do I use? I use a Herman Miller. Uh, I think it, it'd be Aaron. I don't know, honestly, if I use Aaron. Someone... I was going to say, someone should tell him. I'm like, how would they know? I'm wondering if I'm supposed to roll more at 6 and then skip 7 to go 8. I feel like the game right now is how they get to 8 without dying. Because 7 feels really bad to roll on with a lot of, like, a lot of carries being really strong at 8 in particular. How are you, Ben? Um, it's been okay. You know, I'm the type of guy who takes medicine and expects to be cured. Like, expects everything to be cured, but it's not so much the case. Like, I want my hairline to be restored. I want, I want my sadness to fade. I want to win on my TFT games. But you know, medicine doesn't do all that. Begin. I can do this. This console ever? Um, mm, I like the GameCube. It was nice. I only had the GameCube and the Sega Genesis, so I never had the PS2. So I think GameCube was like literally my childhood. What do I think here? You swear Instant is busted? Yeah, but it's like... I thought Dur got sucked. I, I go where the work leads. So this is Last Whisper, Morellos. I need. I go where the work leads. I'll be selling this for Twitch. Have you met my fleet? I'm coming to get you. Now, we begin. Wow, I leveled and I didn't really get it anywhere with my level. Hot on the trail. Hmm. Wow, I didn't find the challenger. I didn't find Zillion. Hmm. Is there a world where you build a Twitch account? Absolutely, but not this world. Look at this guy. I don't find anything. He has a fucking syndicate spat with IE. Bro, can my Twitch even kill the Zyra? Please, little Twitch. Oh, I killed two! Wait, wait, that's that's actually a high roll. I killed two units here? I'm so happy. Have you met my fleet? You better start all this. Maybe that's actually really good on a. Uh, 
kind of her sustain. That's also tankiness. Scrap that's not on my way. Talking this better or trundle better? Probably trundle. Oh, wow, he went tome and he's not popping until later. Okay. Here. It actually might end up going elevators for mid game, actually. Okay, I really need this. This is a fucking great one. Chemtech plus piece of uh, thing. This one's so good. If not, I also want the Shaco. Mm. I actually think this might have been a mistake. If I'm gonna go IE off this, GIF is probably more flexible. Or it's just this for Siege 2. Tonight, I'm feeling greedy. I mean, I probably just sell these, right? I have two crazy pairs, like insane pairs, actually. I like how I took instant injection. This is such a bad idea. Should have taken, <coughs> should have taken bruiser. Thing about this game is like you can't take stuff that scales because you don't know if you, when you'll get it. Like instant injection becomes valuable for me at what stage? Fucking ten. Three pairs. This isn't just good. Oh, it's OP. It's ama it's amazing. But mid late game, like now, like I don't really Let's have. Bounce. Do I have four bruisers? Fuck, I would pivot straight now. Metal is now. harder than black. Because Trundle's a really good um, Urgot Eye of Order. Does this get instant injection? Even though there's no cap. Can? I'm curious. Look at his attack speed. He does not. Wow, really? I guess their bonus skill is often if the, the thing is active. A lot of other things um, have their thing regardless of if it's active or not, like the pirate stuff. But this in particular uh, makes sense. Probably not better than WoW, yeah, yeah, probably is. I never oh. compromise. Holding good time. I'm a solid blitz here. Switching.
I see level here. I have four pairs here. On my way. Ooh, that's a big kid. That's a big I'm kid. gonna okay. knock him dead. Where is it? Okay. Not usable for a guy. Got it. Um Soju always sends Shroud, yeah. I'm pretty sure Shroud's OP, but Makes the rest of my items really awkward, honestly. It's like if you play instant injection, your carry has to be Lissandra or whatever, right? But in this situation, like how can I how can I carry with Lissandra? Oh I lost. Oh, this guy has both different. No wonder I took him off. Damn. Both different. Literally, if you if you RNG two stars, it's just way better than anything. Hmm. Clockwork card, just play Ren Mori. That seems okay. Do that or exiles, but uh. I'm good with that. So here, Someone's oh my about to god, those are huge fucking hits. Um, fuck. Time is wasted. Should down to do this and then play. Love one of these. Actually, I probably should just kept the Alawi or the the other thing. Just play three, not a big deal. Ah, this guy has GS. Not very good for me. You know, I have two star pretty much everything on my board. I'm actually really strong. Uh, like, really strong. Zach by two star there is actually crazy. So, like, from this position, everything's fucked, right? Because usually you'd slam Chalice, but realistically, like, Chalice doesn't do anything in my comp. Right? What's Chalice so strong right now? Uh, it got minorly buffed, and then uh, people realized that the way a lot of the scaling works in this game makes it very good. On my way. By my calculations. Um, a lot of the units have very high base damage values, but require a lot of mana for a second cast, and so. Uh, but have decent first casts. So what happens is people found out that stacking uh, can lead to a lot of benefits. Yeah, I'm really good. I just uh, am really far behind on the gold. But I think it's fine because it means I can roll at 4-5 here. What sucks is just my Urga items are going to be completely awful. Also, I think with Ori, it's really hard to play 5 chem. But you kind of have to play 5 chem if you want any value out of instant. Because the first 2 chem is just fucking awful. So it feels really... Like, I'm in a weird spot because of this. Um, also, like, AP doesn't really work on Urgot, and I think that's kind of where you want to go with this. I'm just, I'm just really, like, in an iffy spot. We can sell all these. Let's get cracking. Usually, when they be level, you won't have to be fifty gold right here. And the, with level six, if you want any chance of going level eight on stage four. But since I'm not, uh, this is fine. Can 
your time has passed. We want to play League. What's the best way to start? Uh, literally on your second monitor have. Oh my God! Just natural every two star or what? On your second monitor, just look for um. I'm feeling uh, the units you play against, or the characters you play against, and then that's it. Just play a lot, and then do that. Call me, hey, call me Ari. Welcome back to play six months. How did the move go? How did he play? I live in the prison cell. I kind of like it. Oh, whoa! A little smash and grab. Huh? Wow, this didn't make my items easier to make. They made my items harder to make. Cause I still am stuck in a. I can't do anything with these items. But now they're. Huh. Hmm. Metal is harder than lead. Wow. I guess I do slam chalice. My defensive items are not terrible. Sorry, I should have the Zach next to this. I don't really know what to do about the other shit. Uh, it's awful. Like, I think. Oh god! If I didn't have Morel, it'd be a Sunfire slam here. I think it's this. I'll take back what's mine. Don't worry, I am here. Oh yeah, natural two star everything. So this should be a fine game. I just go 8 at 4 5 or 5 1. I feel like I'm, I'm in a good spot. Um, probably sell this later. And just AP should go on these two units. Right? Oh, he's dead? At 4 1? What the fuck? Oh. Oh, shit. Okay, that's kind of not what I expected. I think Chalice and Lissandra could actually be pretty good if you had 3 star Lissandra. But 2 star Lissandra, like, do, do you see this damage? 325? Yeah, let me go in perspective. Let me put you put you on what, what a Seraphine is. 450 and it heals. And then you go look at um Ori. Hold on, she's somewhere here, right? Who has fucking Ori? Hello? Uh, 550. So, like, if it's Lissandra... These units have such high base damage, but will never cast more than once, right? Yeah, 325 blows. But obviously she has uh, a reason for that, right? She has the AD reduction, which is nice. That assassin player who just has two IEs and two lockets is actually kind of funny. Is that optimal items? Who knows? But it's kind of fucking funny. I want the bow, but it's uh, impossible to get. Cool. I guess I take the bramble. Okay. I was thinking of redemption here, actually. But you know what? I'll stick with my gut and go for an offensive hybrid and see what I can do. Time to start some trouble. I mean it's fine. I'm not going eight till till five one. And then I'm just playing for top four. I think that's reasonable. Uh I mean I could slam okay, realistically I could slam second. Take a trout here and literally play for top four, but 
Hmm, that feels a little bad. Yeah, instant injection. Like, do you do you guys see this? I fucking picked up instant injection at one four. I haven't used it. It's four five. Imagine if I had an actual augment. That could like be hitting the lobby for more, and then like it actually would be fun. like it hasn't been used for the majority of the game. Oh. It's inject some copium, true. A hopium, wait. Oh! Uh, if I remember correctly, Titanic is crazy. The stage is set. I can actually play Jin this game. It's an inject Titanic, it's kind of crazy. What if it's Mundo Carry? I don't have fucking any items for it. I'm pretty sure you were supposed to slam like a fucking Nether Shroud here and play off this item and whatever item you have to carry. So, um, yeah, the biggest problem with Chalice is like the, <laughs> the units you want to use it on are just not very good in uh, in instant injection because the base damage isn't that high. Mine's Victor 2. Victor 2 has really good base damage, right? But, like, the rest of the stuff is like, eh. Seven out. I mean, I have 50 gold level 8. I should should be able to replace most of my board. We're probably looking at something like uh, 2 Bruiser Frontline, Zach Mundo, and then uh, Ori, and then some random garbage. Maybe it's 4 Bruiser if I can like, catch. Yeah, that might be difficult. A little smash and I didn't get another item. 60 gold. Even more than shop gold. Uh, should I even have done that? That's I pretty fucking clutch. The stage is set. Let's get cracking. Shop blade, shop mind. I don't think I'm making fucking gym 3 here. I don't think I'm making this. I also don't think I'm making this. are fucking scuffed as hell. This unit needs to leave for another Kentech. This is who I am. By your command. Okay, how do I fucking it's like this? I mean this needs to be worry, right? Yeah. 
Let's make their base damage. So it does three death rays. This is who I am. I mean, I'll be honest, I think if I go 9 here, I don't think... Do you think anything changes? This needs to be sold, right? This needs to be sold, I put in Ori. It's like Ori Terror. Ori Jace? Yeah, sure, something like that. Oh, that's the name. We got there are two assassin players in this lobby. Very cringe. Janna Jinx. Um, for Yumi, I don't think I ever played Janna in this comp with Yumi. I just need more damage, right? Or do I need my... Yeah, I just need damage. Um... My third shroud. I don't know about that. The only two assassin players? Well, in this lobby especially, there are a lot of assassin players. Bro, this is such a date. I'm pretty sure... Pretty sure I don't go nine. I'm pretty sure I just like work out three. Going nine feels wrong here. Oh, I can't play for that three. Why the fuck does this guy have an Urgot? Huh? Oh, he has a Kaisa to an Urgot. Cyberblip with the kill. Well, time to make Mundo's rounds. Let that out. Okay, that's pretty big. I don't have really good AP user here for ice cream. If I do this, I fear it won't get the back line. Actually. There's not a lot of backfire when I hit. The replacement Liz and Morel on Yumi. Let me. That's one of the worst things you could have told me to do. Or do I get Titanic? Yeah. So it might be better to keep it on a chin. Like 2080. How much does this give? This lobby is so fucking hard to play. Kinda need to worry, I think. Only problem is I can't roll for I can actually still roll for a got three. I see things clearly. This is very exciting. Existence is torment. Well, time to make Mundo's rounds. Savor the misery. Yep. Grab me their normal drink. I'm really curious. 
Thank you. <coughs> yeah. Oh, I lose this, right? Actually, I don't know how powerful Twin Shot is. I feel like it probably is worth giving up by just to get it. These assassin players are so fucking annoying. Yeah, this assassin player is dead. I got his shape though. Effort to start usually, but it's not worth Ori, right? So you get you get more attacks for every unit in the comp. By your command. I'm pretty much rolling down here to try to hit one of these. Savor the misery. Too late for catch. With utmost efficiency. Existence is torment. I gotta be able to kill some one of these guys, right? Imperial, Last Whisper, Blue Buff, BT, probably BT here. I think I'm just gonna sell her that. I think the chance of me hitting the last I got is like zero, so I'm not gonna bother. I have to just hit the other stuff. Well, time to make Mundo's rounds. Uh, yeah, there's no way. That one guy who was holding Urgot too kind of stood in my dreams of Urgot this game. Savor the misery. It's fine. Super lame, super lame, super lame, super lame. Is Urgot you have to remove it? Nope. I wouldn't have hit another Urgot in the world now. You're fucking trolling. Even going for the Urgot was bad, I think, because of this guy. No, I could have placed top three, I think. I could have won that for sure. Whatever, it's fine. Cat was one to the left. Yeah, I mean he moved it on purpose though, because he was watching me. That sucks. Level of boys? No. Nope. I am Well, I mean technically it's not that far away. So maybe I could just chill and talk for a little bit. If that's okay. Maybe I'll just chill. I don't know if I have to go so quickly. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, usually the placing the top four, like your positioning makes like a couple placements every game. <laughs> but yeah, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask because I'll be gone. I think I have like, okay, let me double check. But I think I have about 30 minutes. Oh my god. Did Ryan raided me? Okay, Ryan's actually got the sickest sleep uh schedule. He streams at like 7 or 8 a.m. And he ends stream before I get on a lot of times. But thank you so much for the raid, Ryan. Welcome to the stream. I'm leaving in 30 minutes. Because I gotta go somewhere. But um, in the meantime, I'm gonna kind of do a quick Q&A. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask. A real quick one sec. Um, I need to double check to make sure that time is uh, is correct. This is point six miles away. Seven minutes. You're good. 30 minutes. Are you playing Soji's TFT Twitch Rivals tourney? Never got an invite, so no. Soju's tourney? Huh, interesting. Goals for 2022 don't have any. I don't set goals. I I I, I should say I don't set resolutions. That's all. My goal every year is the same exact thing, which is be happy with what I do. I asked, it just about family nips, and the answer was hell no, but then the McDonald's clap happened, what changed your mind? <coughs> Nothing. It was a 0.01% chance of it happening. Pretty sure when I said hell no, it was kind of a situation where it's like, yeah, unless extenuating circumstances happen, and it did. I mean, seven syndicate. I don't know if there's a cat for that. It's really just about dodging the Akali and the Shaco, right? Who do I live with? I don't want to answer that just based on your name alone. Post LASIK? It's good. I mean, I was good. Post LASIK is literally six. After six days, nothing has changed since then. It's been great. It's one of the best decisions I've ever made in my life. CFT more is fun this set. Uh, I think it's... I definitely have higher interest than I did last set. I don't even think I've played any games in uh, the, the set expansion. And we're at the point where the, the set expansion is actually coming out in like three weeks, right? Like we're, we're approaching pretty fast. I've played a lot. Where am I going? Don't worry about it. I was living separately? Yeah, it's fine. How much am I enjoying Mustard Arise? I just don't like that I have to hit 6 star village to play uh, to skip my hub quest. Especially with how much tank here it feels like the units are. Think about your P2 model, it's great. It changed nothing. Thoughts on the U.S. prison system and why are you so sad? Ham, get the fuck out. <coughs> you know, I hope to see an arcade season two. Mm. Oh, like... Sharima, but I know it's not going to happen. What new game are you looking forward to? Just Dying Light 2, maybe a little bit of Lost Ark, and that's it. Nothing really has caught my fancy so far. The last couple of years have not been very good. The Peter Biopill is on the floor behind me, actually. Yas is good, but uh, my sleep schedule has kind of been fucked. Uh, I always end up with the room that I feel like is the hottest, or one of the hottest, and so... Oh god, working around that has been pretty difficult. Do you fear the pressure of getting married and starting a family? Um, I don't think it's pressure so much as it'd be nice to spend time with someone. I, but I don't get pressured by, like, friends or family, really. At least... So, 
some of the weddings I thought I'd go to didn't pan out. That's why there's not much pressure. What do you think about Project Zomboid? I think it's it's like an idle game, an idle farm game. I'm not a huge fan of it, honestly. I think it's fun with friends. The catch out for fancy close pursuits, sure, but nothing I really care about right now. <coughs> a few months ago, you're gonna try Dragon Song Ultimate Raid when it comes out. A few months ago, I was more into Final Fantasy, and I think after a month of Final Fantasy, I learned that um. I can't play MMOs without friends. That's why I feel like Lost Ark is going to be similar to me, where uh, I'm going to be playing like a month of Lost Ark and I realize that none of my friends are going to play and I'm going to quit. I'm a ha I don't want to be like a party pooper, but I, that's how I have a feeling of it. You know, TV will play the new WoW expansion again? Bro, the new WoW expansion isn't for like another year plus. Also, it's really sad to play WoW every time and be depressed by the decisions they make about their game, uh, about their artificial gatekeeping for stuff, their time gates, and not feel bad that the game itself just doesn't seem to learn. I think there's smart ways to do what they want to do goal-wise, but it feels like they commonly all the time make wrong decisions when it comes to at least my in general player satisfaction sometimes i feel like they learn after a patch or two and then they just it's like the cycle of abuse starts over you're like maybe they have a it's gonna be better this time you know they won't hurt me again and then you go back and it's painful Oh, Elden Ring? I don't really know how excited I am about Elden Ring. It's a game I'm probably going to play, but it's hard to say. Did you pick up partners to be a double turning? My favorite partner would be Toast, always, for anything. That involves uh, TFT. But, I mean, outside of Toast, it's just the people I enjoy playing with, you know? Box, box, etc. I mean, I don't expect to win. win. The best of our friends right now is probably Chummy. He just hit a thousand LP, and that's really impressive. But um, yeah, Toes doesn't make any more TFT content. Just not each fan again. How do you feel about Monster Hunter Rise? Let me tell you, the worst part about Monster Hunter Rise is not the game. It's the random fucking people who come into my chat and and just without. Any kind of inclination, no prompt at all, just say shit like, Monster Hunter World was better. And I'm just, bro, who the fuck asked? Every fucking hour that I play the game, it happens every fucking time. And I'm just like, I'm just here fucking playing the game and I'm enjoying it. But in chat, it's just like someone just fucking comes in and just says that. And I'm like, who the fuck cares? You know, they got so bad they didn't command for it? Yeah. I think the my I like everything about Monster Hunter Rise. The only thing I don't like is the fact that I think it sucks that I can't I can't skip my hub quests until village level six. Because I tried playing with Siren yesterday, and the fact that we had to go back to Smack Legombies at one star, and they have a <coughs> a stupid amount of health felt really bad. Like it felt like I had to, I had to go backwards in progression. To catch up. That's the only thing I don't like about the game so far. Dice 98 will come back for 10 months. Can we read Grave Song? What is Grave Song? I've been, doing, I've been doing good. How much balance for four people? I mean, it's balanced for like two to four people, right? When using keyboard and mouse, yeah. The keyboard, I think the middle mouse button is the only non-intuitive part about the keyboard. 
Because I think uh, in the past version, they actually had Middle Mouse be um, Control. And it was a lot. Like, I actually played, uh, and it felt fine. But, like, Middle Mouse left click, Middle Mouse right click is kind of just an annoying thing. Because you kind of have to squish. Your middle finger is always on, mouse, on the Middle Mouse, right? But you have to squish your, like, index and your finger to the right of the middle, which I'd always forget, to, like, kind of press the combo. And it's never, it's not a common thing that you use, you know? Your songs of the Wandering in the Veil about the singer. Oh, shh. I need to catch up. That's a point. Did you try rebinding it? I tried to rebind it to control, but then control also has some quick time thing. I might combine. Yeah, it's just, it's... Also, I kind of wish my mouse wheel didn't mouse wheel through my pet commands, because I don't really care about my pets. As much as I like 7up and Sprite, I much rather wish that default ended up being um, my other thing. Like playing League, yeah. I think the problem with League is like when I play League, it feels really unfun for the players that are not on similar skill level. Because what happens is if you're at a higher skill level, you only it's gonna be most fun if you play with people who are kind of around your skill level a little a little bit. Um, at least it is for me. But then if if I'm playing with people around my skill level, it's a lot harder for people who are below to match up, and then the game becomes very miserable for them. I think I ran into a little bit of that when I was doing the VTuber collab. I was like, oh, fuck, man. Like, the people I'm playing against are actually, like, kind of good. Ever missed competing in League? Not at all. Haven't missed competing in League in fucking six years. Six plus years. Probably eight plus years. Box said the exact same thing? Yeah, because Box Box actually cares a lot about how other people in the in the group feel about stuff. He is like hyper focused and aware about how other people in, in his vicinity are feeling. Cause like me, uh, him even more so, he make he likes to make sure everyone has a lot of fun. Him toasts are very similar in that regard. Um but like and if they're not having fun, it's it, it like it's hard to make it fun if you're getting slammed, you know? It's very hard. My Libra, yeah. How would you compare to workload you have in content versus competing? Uh, competing was way harder in every... The challenges are different, but competing, for the most part, like, competing is higher highs, lower lows, is what I always say. Even in the Mort Milk situation, would you block a player that constantly trashes your game? Sure. The fuck? Who cares? It's kind of how I feel about the Toast situation recently, where Toast, like, uh, like did some weird stuff with DMCA, and people are like, I can't believe Toast lied. This is going to make me feel wor like I'm never going to trust him again. And I'm like, the fuck? Hello? <laughs> like, I feel like people are making, like, a big issue out of a non-existent problem. God, dude, okay, recently, I've probably had two or three days of, like, productive days in January. Because I've had moving issues and sleep issues and stuff like that. Um, and every time I tend to take a nap and wake up, something fucking happens where I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Uh, stuff like, uh... Pokey getting harassed? Randomly by a new, by a new fucking... YouTube, uh, YouTube person who got partnered like the same fucking week. That was crazy. I literally, I, it happened, uh, while I was streaming and I passed out and I woke up and I'm just like, what the fuck happened? I was so confused. You, you know, my personal thoughts on Pokey, uh, um, 
not including all the like you know misogyny shit that's been happening to her and has been happening to her for all the years that she's existed i've been around her a lot right ever since she wasn't like as big or she used to play league like every fucking day by herself um it was ever since she became like the face of twitch and for all extents and purposes let's not argue she's like the female face of twitch um they do her they use her for a lot of their promos she was on their fucking twitch app etc right um, I feel like all she does is she tanks hate all the time. She's like the, she like maintains threat, high threat and aggro on people online, fucking incels, women haters, just, just in general. I feel like, uh, people don't really realize how much she tanks. Uh, like, I don't know in MMO terms, I don't know who an off tank would be in relation to her main tank status. So she's talked about quitting in the past and like kind of retiring from at least Twitch or the common eyes. And I'm really kind of curious who like if it's going to really show like how bad it's going to be once she's gone. Because she's like a fucking she's the main tank of the party, man. Now we're at her. She's very confrontational. She's not. I have met very confrontational people. I've had people come up to me. And call me one of the shittiest jugglers in the world. And they were serious. And that my Twitch Rivals team should replace me. Or uh, my fucking Echo Fox team should replace me. That's a confrontational person. What she does is not confrontational at all. She just says like some random opinion of hers. And then. It's like. It's. <laughs> it's her. I have said things that if she had said would get her canceled on the spot. And I remember thinking about those things and being like, man, I'm glad I'm not that popular because I remember uh, making comments on certain topic matters a long, like four or five years ago. Um, and my opinions changed on those matters before where I was like, oh, shit, if I was if people cared. Uh, I would have gotten canceled for some of the stuff I said. I mean, Goosey, welcome back for nine months. But yeah, like I. I honestly, one of the things that's been hard, the hardest for me is always to defend my friends publicly, especially on Twitter, because that platform is usually for me to use to fucking shit post and look at anime VTubers, you know? So I don't really use that platform as a serious kind of like stance on my subject matters. And even though I feel like I should when it comes to things like my friends. Uh, but I remember just waking up and being like, what the fuck? Like t today, it was like a uh, video came out saying... What was it? Pokey does cocaine on stream? And I was just like, bro. You guys are fucking crazy. Like, why is this a thing? Sometimes I feel like truth is stranger than fiction, you know? Yeah, like truth. And she she, I, she made a comment. She's like, guys, I don't need cocaine. I'm like, man, you have to make this comment? Holy fuck. Of course you don't do cocaine, dude. That's a Vaughn. What the fuck? We actually got the wrong member. Who's another VTuber that you want to but haven't had yet to collab with? Um, I don't know. I feel like I'm not a... <laughs> the thing about being a VTuber is I feel like to really appeal to other fans, you have to be really d deep in the hole, so to speak. Like, you have to really appreciate, like, the Japanese culture and the roots that they come from. You have to, like, be willing to, or be willing to watch a lot of like whole alive and be excited about kind of the culture of Japanese VTuber as well. For me in particular, I don't tend to do that. And I'm very upfront about it. I told you I don't really watch corporate <coughs> VTubers very much. Um, and I'm very much like I watch the VTubers that are on Twitch. Um, and so that tends to be relatively isolating, I think, culture wise when it comes to that. When you need content, do you think they'll bring to OTV this year? I mean, they're just really different people on stream. Uh, or, sorry, on camera. Um, we haven't signed anyone in a long time. We're talking about John Jody Sidney. Sorry, I skipped the question. Um, and I think that they add very strong... 
different types of personalities on camera. Honestly, just watch our first video in January. We did Fear Pong. Oh, that one. That one's going to be a good one. That one's a fucking funny one. Because that one, um, you'll see. Do you know how much, exactly how much mustard Ivan eats? She eats a lot of pickles and mustard. Like, it's not, it's not like a, a show. She doesn't put up a front. She actually eats a lot of it. And like, she brags about it. She's like, oh my God, you know, this one is like, I look at how, I got this like, <coughs> look how low calorie this is. This is great. And I'm like, no, shut the fuck up. I personally hate pickles, so it's like the very, it's the inverse of what I stand for, essentially. Any plans to travel with a group? I mean, yes, everyone wants to travel, but like, it's just very... I don't like to talk about things that have no, no like... I don't want to say relevance. Nope. Hmm. How do I say this? Everyone would like to do a lot of different things. But, like, it's not feasible right now in the current position. Because it's just, like, very inconsiderate to try to attempt to travel somewhere. For long, for in, like, large groups to try to do IRL stuff. You know, it's okay. I know some people are going back to see family soon, right? That's a completely different story. But, like, to send, like, five to eight people somewhere and, have like, walk around together feels very bad. COVID did change a lot of things, right? And one of the things that's the most, the, the biggest things that COVID changed is it kind of changed the ability to be spontaneous about stuff. I remember I used to like just hit on my friends and be like, hey, you want to go get dinner at 1? Like 1 a.m.? <coughs> Midnight? Um, I didn't have to live with them and I could do that, right? But nowadays, like, I can't do that. Everything kind of has to be planned and scheduled. It's like, hey, man, are you kind of free in a couple of days? We can go eat at this place. Unless you kind of live with them, like that spontaneity kind of died. And I think that, spontaneity dying kind of killed happiness some of my happiness as well it feels really bad and it's just one of the things where it's like COVID's not leaving like it's not something that's going to go away anytime soon and you have to deal with some of the consequences that comes with a global like pandemic kind of thing and one of those things is not being able to spontaneously do trips maybe in six months like I'll put it this way. Everyone wants to go somewhere. Everyone wants to go on a trip. It's not, it's been a thing that we've wanted to do for fucking two years now, but it's not something that I can ever say is going to happen because I don't know if COVID's ever going away. No. How do we deal with classmates not wearing masks when you're supposed to? Yeah. I mean, one of the things that COVID brought out is just how little some people care. Um, cause a lot of the things that I think, uh, our friend group and me in particular care about is like, uh, consideration, not only for yourself, but also for others. And some, one of the things that you start to realize some of the people that you're friends with or some of the people that you know are willing to take larger risks than you would believe. Um, and I under I think, um, it's, it wasn't something like you'd ever know unless you're really close with them, right? So you're starting to see people's stances on positions uh, very, like, in your face, kind of. And sometimes it's very shocking. It's like, yeah, like, I, like, wear your fucking mask. It's not that hard, you know? But apparently it is sometimes. What would you like to go on a trip to Japan? The only problem is every time we go to Japan, something bad happens. Definitely not the next time, right? There's no way it could happen three times in a row. What happened to the keyboard? All right, I'll tell you. And I'm not proud of this. And do not fucking tell Teha because he will actually murder my ass. So I was talking to someone else about how to clean my keyboard because I wasn't super sure. And um, I was told that like, you know, I could, that uh, using water and a little bit of like uh, soap on a cloth, it would be like the easiest way to do it. 
And I didn't hear that part. So I was just like, oh, I can just run it under the sink. So I have a picture right now on my phone of me running my keyboard under my sink. And when I showed my friend, they were... <laughs> so... Uh, anyways, so it looks great because I fully cleaned it and all my keycaps. But um, I probably have to replace my PCB and the switches. So... Uh, yeah. I'll show I'll share the picture in about in a couple of days when um my because I, I I kind of waited like a week for my keyboard, but anyways I'm currently using Avon's pretty Sailor Moon key keyboard. So if you've been hearing differences in the sound, yeah, there's a reason for that. I can't believe you ran under the sink. You know, I was just talking to someone how I had my in-game keyboard, and then now it's like, well, I guess I can get another in-game keyboard. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I showed my friend, and she literally was like, I think I grew 10 strands of gray hair while looking at this picture. I'm like, oh, oh, whoops. Um, but uh, yeah, so it's currently drying right now. I'll probably try, I'm going to try to see if it runs, but I definitely need to get my switches relubed. Oh, maybe a good time to try these switches and uh, probably need to get my PCB completely. It's probably completely fried. So I probably need uh, some help in that. It's drying. It's it's like a thing where you don't want to turn it on early in case it's not fully dried. So it's just out there for a bit. <sighs> Did I just start streaming? Don't, don't fucking say anything. Don't say shit. Nothing fucking happened. Don't tell them anything. The only thing you're you're allowed to tell them is, uh, good morning, good night, what a nice day today. At least it's clean. Oh, it looks great. Like I cleaned all the keycaps. Uh, even the board looks great. <laughs> yeah. Oh god, let me actually let me actually see if I can show you. I'll post this later. I only wanted to post the picture in, in case my keyboard wasn't completely fried. Because then it's just a funny story. Um, but if, if, if it is fried, then it's not a funny story anymore, right? Then it's, um, then it's a problem. I don't know if you... <sighs> this looks so bad. Can you guys see this? Oh man. Yeah, it's it's just a funny story, guys. But on Twitter, uh, maybe in a couple of days, because I have to see if it it works. And if it works, then it's just a funny story. Is it working? Oh no. Uh <laughs> Patricia, don't worry about it. When they ran the keyboards and the dishwasher came out perfectly, but custom keyboard. Oh, I need to get my keys, my switches relieved. You revealed it without testing? I can, don't worry. I'll test it in like a couple of days. Actually, I'll test it tonight. I'll see if it works. Someone snitch? Who, who is that guy? Tell me their name. I need to ban them. Do you have a favorite character model from all the VTubers you play with? Um, T.U.? Wait, what the? You guys are snitches, dude. What happened about protecting the homies? Uh, favorite model? Oh, wow. Um, I love Maya's new model. Um, oh, God. They're all fucking good. What that's what the homies do? Yeah, yeah, that's what the homies do. You didn't host Teha? Ugh. 
Oh man, I I feel like it's something where, um, like sending someone that picture, it looks like it's like a a fucking meme. Like someone did that and like either photoshopped it or like did it just, just as a as a fucking prank. But I was the clown all along. For, for uh, the painting, <laughs> the pay the the painting you got for Lily Michael. Did you just let the printer do their own stuff? You give them the idea to print. Oh, uh, the painter. Oh yeah, they they did it for me. I legit reverse Google search. Yeah, Patricia was helping me out uh, with cleaning, and then uh, you know, it's kind of huh, kind of some bad stuff. Embrace it, send them up, send it to them and host them when you leave. Bro. Holy fuck. Wait, 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 wait. Let me, it's, hold on. Most keyboard PC beat or two layers would be fine to dry it. I want to toss the rice, which are probably gone. Yeah. I think the loop, the loop part of my switches are probably done for, right? <laughs> you might have a heart attack. <laughs> Yeah, you gotta start your year off strong, man. You gotta give your heart some protection. The screams are hella broken in? Yeah, they were. I've used them for like two years straight. But I might, it might be a good time to switch switches to try something else. Well, let's talk about what? Gatorons? Talk about random stuff? I'm down to give it a shot. You get Kaz's villain arc? Bro, it's okay. It's still gonna work, and then it's just gonna be a funny story. You know? I'm telling you guys, it's just gonna be a funny story. Like, haha, don't you remember with Skara and then you finish the, the sentence, right? Was it the game con you first met Toastat? Yeah, I think so. This will be the last story after Tayon comes for you. Don't worry about it. How much are you probably seeing at rent? I mean, moving down, don't worry about it. I feel like I'm comfortable sharing some things, but people are just like very. I don't want to share everything in my life. Like, I kind of already share what, what like, shampoo and body wash I use, like, I'd like to have a little bit of privacy. I feel like the more I share, the worse it is for me. Because people are going to be like, wow, they moved and they're paying this amount. Was it really worth, the like, quantifiably, was it worth breaking up the OTV house for a difference of this amount of money? Especially when Pokey's there, and she's the face of Twitch, and she's a millionaire, and she does cocaine. So, with all those things on board, like, I really don't think they should have done that. Do you want a full-size red keyboard? <laughs> we'll see. See if it works. My Aesop Soap review? Unironically, <coughs> my, the Aesop Soap is my favorite hand soap I've ever had in my life. Um, the way it... I don't know how to... Like, you know how you... Quant, like qualified taste like it's sweet it's sour uh like umami like it hits certain like kind of taste buds like you really appreciate like the texture stuff like that i don't know how to how to do that for hand soap but aesop soap is actually kind of insane like i'm i thought it was a meme but like i'm literally down to just i don't use like it's hard to use hand soap right spending 50 dollars on hand soap every every six months yeah, that seems all right All you use is Aesop is worth it. No, it's really nice. Like, it's very nice. I don't think you can dry out the switches properly without taking them apart. Oh, well. Maybe I'll just, uh. Maybe we'll just hang my keyboard in the living room. And then when people look at it, they're like, haha. And I'll be like, haha. You know? It, it, 
that that's what I I prompt them with. You won't believe this. This is just a funny story. And then they'll look at me and be like, and ha I can't wait for that. Hey, Em, welcome back for four months. <coughs> My brother's just thinks I'll promise to Singapore and much cheaper there for some reason. Really? They're really great, honestly. Except you revealed it before it worked. Okay. Look, reveal. It's okay. Ten percent of Americans have tried cocaine. Dude, I live in LA, okay, so I know of people, or I've heard stories about drugs. I've never touched cocaine, but it's just some of the stories I've heard. I'm like, you guys are fucking crazy, man. What the fuck is, bro? I just sit inside and play video games. <laughs> oh my my sorry, my mic was actually turned upside down, so if you didn't hear me that well. Adjusting the LASIK, there's no adjustment. After six days, it's completely normal. Just am shark well after three months. Wait, is it burning? How is it burning? Hold up. I think it's just a, yeah, I think it's a grounding thing. My my desk is not stable, actually. So, like, if I slam my desk, it kind of fucks with me. Yeah, the, the Teha thought was funny, right? Someone sent him the clip of, of, the, of the picture. He thought that was funny, right? Like, haha, good joke. EC twenty twenty two. Nah, I actually. God, I'll see. I prefer. I think I prefer Coachella. I think Coachella is definitely more my vibe because I like uh the variety of music. Forgotten the cloud. Welcome back for four months. You approach new things about where you where you're going to do before you do or going blindly. Uh. Good frame. I like to approach things with a good framework and with areas to work around. There's no. He said it's funny, but he wants to know your current location. <laughs> oh god, I've been to Coachella never. I'll see you at EDC. I'll see you again at EDC, man. Well, we still hearing that. Yeah, it's nice. Um, I have to go in like ten minutes, so just a quick, quick heads up. Maybe I will raid Teha, and then we can all laugh together. It'll be like a communal. Ha ha. All Lily's fault, <laughs> dude. I literally forgot until today, and I was like, "Oh my god." Any big OTV plans, shoots plans in the future? Ask bro, I have no fucking idea. Is that adorable? Opinions on the evolution of streaming. I want to ask you this. Uh, see an amazing demo on a streamer. Uh, because I'm watching a race in high school and get attention the quickest. Oh, I don't think it matters. Like, in the, in the grand scheme of things, I don't think the evolution of streaming. Like, I'm assuming you're talking about React meta. I don't think it matters. I think Twitch wants to pay the least amount for certain things, like uh, being able to use DMCA free music, for instance, or being able to, like having like Amazon watch parties are not able to cover like everyone. I feel like 
the I think the one thing I want to say is that I I would I think watching stuff with people is great. Um, when Crunchyroll did their their um, was it week long thing where they went through like what was it, every Yu Gi Oh episode or something like that or every Pokemon episode it was fucking great it was super cool. I love watching stuff with people and like it's the chat makes it amazing. It can make bad episodes fucking great. Um, it just sucks that like they're ha- they haven't found a way to kind of make that feasible. Crazy content like vulgarity, anything out of the norm. I mean, it's just normal to. There's one dangerous thing when it comes to content creation, especially when you tend to be on the edge. Um, there's a period of time where you keep wanting to to go up and up with what you do. I call it, or it's like escalation. Um, I know that a lot of IRL streamers kind of fell into this thing where like they had to go up and hey, what's up? Are we going? Soon. Soon as in what, like five minutes? Uh, what, what time is it? Yeah. Oh, then yeah. <laughs> I'll see you in five minutes. <laughs> Thank you, Yvonne. Thank you, Gavin. They they had, um, oh my, they went to Tea Master today. It's literally the, apparently the best, the best matcha tea place. It's got like literally like 1,500 reviews at five stars. And has Sean said he hates green tea, but he still loved this place. Oh, wow. He watched Devin Nash's re- video on the React Meta. I don't watch any Devin Nash videos. I don't need to watch any videos on on this kind of stuff because I'm very low to the floor when it comes to what's happening. So I don't need to be like updated or find kind of figure out what happened, you know? Oh, it's fucking great. It's like a it's like a literally like a nine out of ten. So um I find that a lot of those things are like just him saying stuff that's like I don't know. I feel like people just tend to repeat stuff, including myself. And I don't think I gain much out of. Hmm. It's like those news articles that always report on what streamers do, um, just for fun. I followed um, what is it, Dextero, just to see every article that they posted on Pokey <coughs> or Toast, and they would post one every fucking day. <coughs> and it would just be an article of the clip that happened the day before, and I just like, and the article is one paragraph long. <laughs> This is fucking journalism in 2021, 2022. Come on. Bubba, you got that. Welcome back for 33 months. I love this place has a thousand, over a thousand views and it's five stars. No, it's crazy. It's so good. But yeah, like, I don't worry, guys. I, I should be done coughing in a couple of days. I got anti inflammatory. Inflammatory. Tory medicine as well as antibiotics. So give me like five days and that should be good. According to the best of predicting metas and adapting themselves, it's kind of unfair because I think if you're really big, you can make the meta. Predicting metas is kind of only able to be done by people who are like top 50 on Twitch, so to speak. Also, there's some people who don't give a shit about the meta. Like, Soda is very, very... Um, I actually really like Soda. Um, I aspire to be kind of like what he is, minus some of what like he is. <laughs> um, and then he'll just... He'll commonly try to trend away from popular stuff. Um, I don't want to trend that far away, but like he does it on purpose all the time. I think it's really interesting. I should love him. He's great. I'm kind of happy that of all the people who've been around a long time, still this kind of been around for quite a bit. I don't think he's kind of a... I don't think he's necessarily like Kanye Light or like a, a role model, so to speak. And I don't think that a lot of streamers strive to be. I think he's just always been very relevant, and he's very interesting. Mm-hmm. 
for all my expensive hobbies, the cost for health insurance, don't even know when I paid for it. Almost irrelevant. Two personal, who am I currently living with? I'm living with Yvonne. You can guess the other people. Oh, I didn't go. Apparently there's traffic, guys. Peace. I'm gonna raid Teha. And you guys can just we can all laugh together. That'll be a good raid. Oh, this will be this will be a good one. This all right, guys. I'll see you guys maybe later tonight. Uh, probably come back uh, and stream again. So, peace. If not tomorrow, peace.